1-7. Hey, what's up guys? Black Sheep here, and I have a box of the brand new 2019-20 OPG Platinum Hobby Edition. So this is really cool. You get one hard-signed autograph per box, as it says right there, and you're getting 20 packs per box with four cards per pack. This box is, isn't is too expensive, but you're only getting one autograph. Lots of, uh, you're gonna get some parallel cards. It's very, very similar to what I would say, like if, if you're gonna compare it to baseball, it's like Topps Chrome, because basically what they've done here is they've taken the OPG base cards and foiled them out with um, a foily chrome look. And that's basically what this product is. Uh, you only get four cards per pack, so there's not that many cards per pack. And I've said this many times recently on this channel, but I wish that parallel cards were a bit more popular in hockey than they are. I just don't see the interest in parallel cards as, you know, basketball. I mean, if you get parallel cards in basketball, they are worth insane amounts of money. In baseball, same thing. Like... You get parallel cards, and those prices are through the roof. Um, when I switched and started baseball cards, um, not switched, but when I started getting more baseball cards on this channel and basketball, I realized suddenly how big parallel cards are. So if this product was a baseball product or a basketball product, I think this would probably be one of the most popular sets. As it is... Um, Eh, it's in the middle. We're going to start with the Miko Rantanen. Miko Rantanen base card. That's what the base card looks like. And we're going to flip it around. This is what the back of the base card looks like. It's in full color. Uh, your standard stuff. Nothing crazy about it at all. Uh, the LPG design looks okay here with the chrome. I'm not like going gaga over it, but it's alright. So there we go. Okay. So here's our first parallel card. It's a Philippe Forsberg, and you can see it's like a rainbow foil. I, I think this, they just call it the rainbow. Yeah, here it says rainbow, so uh, it's nice that they have the name of the parallel. All right, um, let's see. Just one thing here. All right, there we go. Okay, next up we have JT Miller and then Jake Gunsel. You're not going to find a lot of vet hits in this, or, or maybe none. Maybe just like a few. I don't know. Maybe they're very, very rare. But this is primarily uh, looking for rookie autos on card. Alexander Texier, marquee rookie. This is the regular base rookie card. And we got a Martin Feveri. Feveri. You guys are going to butcher me in the comments. I don't know. Martin Feveri, I'm just going to say it that way, Rainbow Prism Rookie. So for example, if you got like a Zion Williamson parallel card from a set like this, it goes $800 to $1,000, and I don't see that happening with hockey. Joel L'Esperance, this is the Retro Rookie, and then the Jonathan Marcheseau. So yeah, uh, I guess Cards Infinity, they had a Prism Zion, not Prism, it was Donruss Optic, Donruss Optic, four cards per pack, just like this, you get the same type of stuff, 800 bucks for the Zion, insane. Jakob Slavin, base, Artem Anisimov, is this a pink parallel? I think they call this matte pink, yeah, matte pink, right there, matte pink. Brock Nelson and Mika Zibinajad. Mario Ferraro. Elias Pedersen. Connor Hellebuck. And Andre Vasilevsky. Lots of shimmer and shine. It's actually kind of hard for the camera, I think, to pick it up, especially with the lighting I have. We got a Jack Hughes. 
Hopefully when they start up again, Hughes will be a lot better or get better. John Carlson, of course, how can you get better if you're just sitting around? Brad Marchand, best in the world. Nick Backstrom. So yeah, I don't know if they're, I mean, they're obviously, I don't know who's using this time, you know, off to work on their games, but I imagine there's a lot of people just sitting around. Nikolai Pro Prokorkin. Okay. And Phil Kessel. I really like these Sunset Parallels. They are gorgeous looking cards. Good job, Upper Deck, on those. Miro Heskinen and Oscar Clefbaum. Hey, nice. We got a Quinn Hughes. Quinn Hughes, marquee rookie. And, oh, this guy is following me around, and this is not a bad one to get. Dominic Kubalik. I got his auto in SPX, and now we're getting his auto here on card in OPG Platinum. So that's a nice one. Zach Parise, Casey Middlestack. So it's really cool. I think most people are fishing out those autos, but I really want to get a rare parallel card. I think that'd be really cool. Of a good rookie, of course. Aaron Eckblad, Noah Dobson, Joe Pavelski, former Shark, Rainbow Foil, and uh, Anthony Mantha. All right, Sergei Bobrovsky, Trent Frederick, Eric Brandstrom, and Alex Petriangelo. Okay, Braden Point, Jack Eichel, Rainbow, Retro Rainbow, Malkin, and Getzlaff. Ah. All right, Johnny Hockey, Carl Grunstrom, and a Tevo Teravinen Red Prism. I don't believe these are numbered. Oh, they are numbered to 199. Red Prisms are 199. And a Ryan Sutter. Okay, Claude Giroux. Nick Suzuki. Kale McCarr. I like that one. Kale McCarr. He's probably my favorite rookie out of all of the um, rookies this year. Kopitar. All right. Let's let that focus. There we go. Sam Lafferty, Gustav Nyquist, Nico Sturm, and Mikkel Bodker. All right, Nicholas Haig, Brent Burns, Rainbow, Ryan Ellis, and Ovi. It's a small box, but there's a lot of packs, so it's nice. Sebastian Aho, Blake Lazat, and then Alex Debrinkat, Thrilling Finishes. And a Landeskog. Tyler Bertuzzi, Calder front runners, Adam Fox, Philippe Grabauer, and Mark Shifley. All right, Oliver Wallstrom, Alex DeBrincat, William Carlson, and Mark Andre Fleury. All right, we're getting towards the end here. I don't think OPG Platinum is the most exciting product to rip, actually. I don't see myself getting much more of this stuff. Matthew Tuchuk, Rasmus Dalin, Jonathan Joanne, Artem Anisimov. If par like I said, if parallels were just more popular in hockey, then maybe, maybe I'd have more interest in this. Adam Boquist. But I do know, I do know people like this product. Matthew Barzell, Tobias Bjornfot. That's a nice looking parallel card. 
number to 399 and Jeff Carter. So, so far, this is the last pack. I don't think there's anything like super rare in this, but the the rookie auto was nice. Alexi Sorella, Ovi, Eric Stahl, and Colton Pareko finishes us off. All right. Um, where is that rookie auto? Here it is. So here is the best card from the break. Not a bad card to get. Dominic Kubalik. Kubalik. Um, rookie auto. On card. Blue ink. Really nice. Um, I will do a giveaway for this video. I'm not sure what I'm going to give away yet. Maybe a nice parallel. We'll see what happens. But same rules as always. All you have to do is like this video and be subscribed to my channel. Leave a comment telling me what you thought of this year's OPG Platinum. And include the words, I'm in. If those aren't there, I can't include your entry. I'll give you a bonus shot at winning if you go to my written review and leave a, a comment there with your YouTube username. And I'll leave a link down below. So check down below in the descriptions for that. Hopefully enjoy the review. I'm going to check out these cards and uh, really see what I think about them. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time.